hold up. You got Mo Betas without me? Yep. How dare you? Wanna fight about it? Maybe later. Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Today is very exciting. I've been waiting for it since the day we picked up this Range Rover. That's kind of underplayed. You're so excited. You made it sound like, yeah, I'm pretty excited. But no, she's been absolutely ecstatic about this. Ever since we bought this Range Rover, Faith just could not wait to wrap the car. And it did take her about a month to pick a color. It did. Um, I'm pretty stoked on the color. More on that later. So you guys already saw us wash and prep the car. So we just did a simple wash outside. We clay barred it, made sure it was all good to go. The next step on the list, the next thing on our agenda is what? D for disassembly. D, what, are we spelling something out? WDV nights with some auto wrap. WDV, the DMV. Washing, disassembling, and vinyl wrapping. How about disassemble, motivate, vinyl wrap. DMV. I like mine better. The DMV. I have a confession to make. I may or may not have already started off camera. I took, she jumped the gun. I took the emblems off the front. But you did film it though, right? I did. So what is that? This is a um, tips and tricks with faith, or should it be tips and tricks I with don't Clayton? Know if you guys want to learn from me? This is just a normal drill by Milwaukee, and this is a 3M eraser wheel. This is what we use to get rid of the 3M double stick tape. And I know you guys are here to see what color the Range Rover is. You're gonna to have to be patient. You're gonna to have to wait just a couple minutes longer while we disassemble the car, but it's gonna be well worth the wait because this is a really cool color we got. I'm pretty proud of it. Right. I, I don't know why I'm proud of it. I'm proud of the people who made it because it's such a cool color. <laughs> so, Faith, <clears throat> what panels are we gonna be removing first? <clears throat> How about you remove the door handles because you're really good at that, and I'll remove everything else. Everything, okay. Is. Too easy. Yeah, done. After tail lights, you just kind of. Oh, Woo! Two lights down and three door handles down. All right, you're beating me. Fourth one's gonna take me uh, ten seconds. It's all about that uh, WDV, right? What does that stand for again? Wash, disassemble, and vinyl wrap. Yeah. Well, and clean. I'm cleaning it. So W D C. Nah, that's making it too complicated. Ah. Easy peasy. All right, I think we did enough of disassembling. What do you think? Yeah, I mean that took us 25, 35 minutes, and. Uh, you got a little watch there. Yeah. It's a half pass of freckle. Okay. I think that's enough disassembly. Clayton is confident he can do the front bumper without the headlights out. The doors are all disassembled. And honestly, I really like disassembling because it's kind of cool to see what the car looks like without some of its uh Yeah, the Range pieces. Rover the Range Rover is unique because like the doors are all covered. Yeah. Uh so uh You ready? Oh you missed, I just made it. Yeah, I'm ready, I think, oh. Anyways, what I was trying to say, I said, I think it's time to unveil the color. The reason this vinyl is so dang cool, is it is super, super top secret. As you can see, there's no labels on this box because nobody needs to know who made this vinyl. <laughs> so like Clayton said, it is top secret because this vinyl actually has not been released yet. So they made seven rolls of this and we got one of them. I'm not sure who else got the other rolls, but I like to say that we're the first people to try this vinyl out. I think we're most likely the first people to put this color on a Range Rover ever. <laughs> I am confident in saying that, yes. <laughs> I have a feeling I am going to love it. You ready? Oh, it's gonna go so good with the black two-tone. So how should we unveil the color? Let's do a spinny spin. Ready? Sp <laughs> okay. Ready, one, two. <laughs> There oh man, okay guys, I know what you're thinking. This isn't crazy, this isn't like super obnoxious, but I'm not kidding you, the camera is not capturing how glorious this color is. So it's a matte, red, blackish color, and it kind of shifts depending which way you're looking at it 
but the color is so velvety. Oh my gosh. Sorry that it's not a flashy color like pink or highlighter green. I think Range Rovers are elegant and they need an elegant color. Oh yeah. Dude. That is an elegant color. Wow, that looks so good. It's gonna be so perfect on a Range Rover. Oh I know, it's perfect for a Range Rover. Sal, you don't look very uh, impressed. Or is that because you've had a long day of sleeping? Mm -hmm. All right guys, we waste no time. I am ready to wrap this car. You ready? Oh yeah, let's start cutting vinyl. Let's get start applying it. Sal, excuse me. We're trying to film here. Quiet on the set. Quiet on the set. As you can see, we are cleaning the panel. <laughs> <laughs> it is the moment we have the all be waiting for. Oh yeah. That color is gorgeous. Yeah, that's really good. You think is this final pretty easy to work with? Yeah, it's final rocks. Final rocks? Yeah. It looks good. You doing that door next? Yep, doing this door. You're doing the front fender? Yep. Day. What time is it? It's uh, Oof. 4 45 in the morning. So we started about 11 hours ago, uh, which I think is pretty impressive. We wrapped the whole car, that the two tone, in 11 hours. We still have two little pieces to do, but I'm exhausted. I'm just gonna do those in the morning. <laughs> you deserve some sleep, my friend. And I'm pretty sure Sal's ready for bed too. All right, we'll just see you guys in the morning. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day, and although those were some pretty rough 12 hours, Clayton killed it though. Rough 12 hours, I am so impressed that we got it done. This was the last thing that we had to finish up were these gills. Uh, they were silver, and they look so good now. So you guys are probably wondering why the heck the car looks so dang good, and that's because I actually ceramic coated this this morning. I did two coats of Avalon King's Armor Shield 9, and let me tell you, it deepened the color so much. If you guys are familiar with our channel, you've probably seen me ceramic coat a couple of cars. And to be honest, it is the best and easiest way to protect the paint of your car without having to spend thousands of dollars. I'm pretty excited to have my own car protected by ceramic, which means it's going to help protect against bug guts, bird droppings, acid rain, any type of graffiti. I mean, hopefully nobody graffitis this car, but you never know. Any of you who have done a ceramic coating, you know what's coming next. So I took a before and after here. So here's the before. And here's the after of two coats. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes. I am so stoked, you guys. Let's do other panels. 
So I don't know about you guys, but uh, I don't think I've ever met anyone who doesn't like their car to beat up that well. Now if you are one of the guys that does want their car to beat up really well, head over to the link in my description for a special offer from Avalon King. So I would love to have a grand reveal for you guys, but I mean you've already seen most of the car. But I am going to pull it out and get some glamour shots for you guys. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed our vinyl wrapping video of the super top secret color. Let me know if you love or hate it. Um, I'm gonna be a little confused if you hate it because I don't know how you could hate this color, it's gorgeous. But thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next video.